August 30th marks the International Day of the Victims of Enforced Disappearances, a day dedicated to shedding light on the grim reality of enforced disappearances, a tactic often employed by states to silent dissent and instill fear. This year, the issue took center stage as protests were held across Europe by the Free Balochistan Movement and various human rights organizations, highlighting the ongoing crisis in Pakistan's regions including Balochistan, Sindh and Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. These protests underscore the dire human rights situation and the growing demand for global action. On August 30 every year, the United Nations observes the International Day for Enforced Disappearance all over the world. Enforced disappearances involve the arrest or abduction of a person by or on behalf of the state followed by a refusal by the same authorities to acknowledge it. The move is used as a means to silence the opposition and spread terror. In London, the Free Balochistan Movement, a group advocating for Baloch independence, organized a protest outside the British Prime Minister's residence. Demonstrators carried banners, placards and photos of the disappeared, chanting against the severe human rights abuses in Balochistan. The protest attracted not only Baloch activists, but also British human rights advocates, all united in their call for justice for the victims of enforced disappearances. Um, I'm here today as a British person to speak up for my Baloch brothers and sisters, what they have been experiencing in Balochistan, where there have been enforced disappearances, where their family members get arrested and then they disappear and then they don't get seen again or their mutilated bodies are found much later. We as British people we should be speaking up and we are calling on Keir Starmer, our Prime Minister, to speak against what the Pakistani authority are doing to Baloch people because it is a genocide. Meanwhile in Amsterdam, the Free Balochistan Movement's Netherlands branch held a similar demonstration drawing attention to the brutal practice of enforced disappearances perpetrated by Pakistani forces. These protests emphasize that enforced disappearances are a widespread issue, tarnishing Pakistan's human rights record. However, the issue is not isolated to Balochistan. Reports of enforced disappearances have surfaced across multiple regions in Pakistan, including Sindh, Khyber Pakhtunkhwa and parts of Punjab, where activists, journalists, human rights defenders, students and political opponents have been targeted. On this International Day, the GS Hind Freedom Movement made a powerful appeal to the international community, including the United Nations and Amnesty International, urging them to intervene and help recover missing persons from Sindh, Balochistan, Pashtun areas, Saraiki regions, Gilgit, Baltistan, and Kashmir. जिनके रियासती एजेंसियों घर या रोड हलंदे खंबे पांजे अकुबत खानन में वे जनतियों जिते के इन मुख्तलिफ टार्चरन के मून डेनों पावे थो उपतो लटकायन नक्क में चुन जो पानी वे जन नह कड़न ओजागु करायन रियासती इदारा आजादी पसंद सिंधी कारकुनन के मारे मारे कदें जेनी तक कदें वरी जिस्मानी तोर मफलूच करे शदिन था तक कदें वरी इनन जा लाश तो फो करे मोकल्या वन्यन था एक अंदाजे मुझब सन 2002 खां वठी 2024 ताई सिंध मा 5000 खां वधीक जीएसएन जे कारकुनन के मिसिंग कहे हुए आए ये का सरासर इंसानी हकन जी खिलाफ वर्जी आए पाकिस्तान जे बेन मजलूम कोमन ते भी रियासती डाट जारी आए एं बलोचन जा बावी अजार कोमी कारकुन जबरी तोर गुम कया वे आएं पश्तूनन जा चार अजार मानु गुम आएं जदें ते सराय की गिलगिती एं कश्मीरी कोमी कारकुन भी वडे अंग में रियासती दारन हाथा गुम किया गया है इनफोर्स डिसअपीयरेंस जे ऑल मीडिया रे थे जीएसएन फ्रीडम मूवमेंट अपील करे थी यूनाइटेड नेशंस 
एमनेस्टी इंटरनेशनल समेत आलमी जमीर खेत जबरी गुमकल सिंधी बलोच पश्तून सरायकी गिलगिती ए कश्मीरी कारकुन के पाकिस्तानी इदारन का बाजियाब कराए वे Enforced disappearances remain a critical human rights issue in Pakistan with new cases continually coming to light despite the pledges of successive governments to criminalize the practices there has been a very slow movement on legislation which is equal to nothing while people continue to be forcibly disappeared with impunity the pakistani government's inaction and failure to address these disappearances have led to increasing frustration and distrust among affected communities.